y'all i'm Xtina, and welcome to or welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be doing a thrift with me slash try on thrift haul so yeah enjoy let's go so at this thrift store i like starting out in the lingerie i love going through the lingerie section it's the perfect place to find cami tops slip dresses corsets Right now, I'm really picky with what I thrift. Like, it has to be exactly what I want for me to pick it up. Like, this was really cute, but I don't know. I think it's only because it was like a piece of fabric and it didn't cover anything, so I didn't get it. So, on to the purple section. We start out by finding this super cute Bisu Bisu cami top. It was so freaking adorable, and it officially became the first item of the haul. Pink is one of my favorite colors to thrift. I can always rely on the pink section to have something super cute. But right here, it just, it wasn't giving over here. Like over here, you can see me checking out these pants to see if they were juicy. They weren't, so they were a pass. Okay, now I know the hot pink section has to have something. Let's see. Oh, this cami top was super cute. And I didn't get it. I have no idea why I didn't get that. That was so cute. But I did find these track pants. They were so freaking hot. They were from Hallie Bob. And the velvet was so nice. And I love the HB on the booty. The black section is also one of my favorite sections to thrift. There's always some hidden gems in the black section, okay? Like over here, we have this gorgeous lingerie baby doll dress. This dress is freaking amazing. The Mogoff Dream from Kissable Coquette. Add to the cart. We're still in the lingerie section, but when I go thrifting, I like to go through every single section, okay? Women's, men's, kids, plus size, maternity. You just never know what you can find and where you can find it. Right here, I'm showing you the white section to show you how I skip the white section. I hate looking in the white. Everything looks the same. and I'm just not a white type of girl. And this was cute, but it was giving fast fashion, which it was. <laughs> so blue is my favorite color, but it's also one of my least favorite colors to go through when I'm thrifting. But like I said, I just go through everything because you just never know what you could find. Like, this was cute. It was giving fairy grunge, but not cute enough for me to pick it up. <laughs> so, this is the cart so far. I already found so many super cute things. It's giving black, pink, and the rare white. <laughs> On to the denim section. We started out with this amazing micro mini skirt. It was so hot by Paris Blues. Automatic pickup. On to the tank tops. So we're back in the pink section. We first find this hot pink sequin top. I didn't end up getting it, but I kind of regret that. That was kind of cute. And then over here, we have some Forever 21. I already know because I have the baby tee version of that shirt. And then we came across this gorgeous purple corset. It was rhinestone embellished and it had pearl straps. It was giving costume, but I was still into it, okay? <laughs> I did end up putting it in my cart, but I didn't buy it because something was wrong with one of the straps. I love looking in the active wear section because that's where I find most of my juicy. But over here, we find this amazing olive green track pants. It had flared legs and it was velour, but you guys, the back. It had this bedazzled Levi's pocket, but as you can see, like some of the rhinestones were missing, so I just ended up cutting out the rhinestones, so now the pocket is plain because I just needed to have this, so that's how I fixed it. <laughs> Now we're in the sweater section. When I tell you I love the long sleeve section, okay? Way more than the tanks or anything else. I just love a good long sleeve. But we found this super cute Chanel sweater. It was a really nice blue and white striped colorway and we had to have that. The cart is already looking full and we still have some ways to go. This was interesting but hella damaged with a lot of bleach stains. 
but y'all I found this Abby Dawn jean jacket. This thing is freaking amazing, okay? It was so hot. It had studs. Like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Okay, like, come on. Automatic pickup. Now we're in the accessories. To be honest, I rarely find accessories, but I found these super cute cheetah print earmuffs and I had to get that. They're so amazing. I already made a couple outfits with them. They're so good. And then I found this. This was interesting. It was a really cute cap and I did add it to the cart, but I think I realized later that it was a kid size. So yeah, didn't end up getting that. And now we finally made it into the kids section. I love going through the kids section, especially the mini skirts. But overall, just because there's so many misplaced items, they always put adult items in the kids section and then they always mark it for cheaper. But yeah, right now I'm just going through the mini skirts and seeing what they have. The kids section is the perfect place to find micro mini skirts. I found these plaid pants. They were interesting. I should have checked that out more, but I didn't end up getting that. And now we're on to the long sleeve tops. I found this super cute denim jacket. It had the lace up the back and it was from Arizona. But it was a size 7-8, so definitely too small. I love anything with skulls, but this was not it. <laughs> Back to some more skirts. This first one was cute, but it was a little bit too small. But this one, you guys, it's this super hot micro mini skirt from Express. It was definitely an adult size. I'm telling y'all, always check the kids section, okay? Here's an overview of my cart so far, but while we're here, I might as well mention I hate going through the pants section. It's one of my least favorite sections. But you can find some amazing things, especially in the jeans section. And that's everything that I decided to pick up. Make sure you stay tuned for the try-on portion of the haul. So today we're going to be doing a thrift haul. If you don't know, I sell on Depop. I'm a Depop seller. My at is at the Grinch doll, the same name as this YouTube channel. So if you're interested in anything that I show here, check it out down below. <laughs> but yeah, I have a whole bunch of Y2K, Mog Off, Grunch. You guys know the drill. Like, you know, I'm an aesthetic type of girl. So I dabble in a lot of aesthetics and that's what I'll be showing here today. But we have some a1 pieces in here okay so to start off to start off with a banger i have these hot pink track pants and like before i'll insert the try on pictures but yeah these just have hb on the booty and these stripes down the side like these baby pink stripes and they're a velour material and these are so freaking adorable for like little i don't know paris hilton vibes with just like a track jacket some sneakers a mini purse you know the vibe this is a lingerie micro mesh dress it just looks like this the try on will definitely do this one more justice but it's completely see-through it has a little bow in the front and it's by kissable coquette for all the coquette girls this is like dark coquette though i don't know if dark coquette is a thing but if dark coquette was the thing this would be dark coquette it's giving mog off and it has like pink lettuce trimming and the back has this keyhole or just super huge cutout this mog off hoodie it has this skull on the back and it just says, oh, Affliction. This is actually by Affliction. And it has the stars down the sleeve. And on the front, we have another bedazzled skull. If you're petite, you can wear this as a dress. I tried wearing it as a dress, but just a little, 
a little too short for me to make it work as a dress but you know super hot this white terry cloth baby fat mini dress well this was not really a mini dress it's more like a midi dress and it has a heart pocket with the baby fat logo these super hot jeans now jeans i don't thrift a lot of jeans anymore i feel like in my store jeans just don't do well even though i have some freaking amazing jeans i'll insert some pictures somewhere on the screen of these amazing freaking y2k flare jeans i have in my store but they get like no attention and they're so hot so i don't tend to pick up jeans even when i see super cute ones but this one like i couldn't resist look just look at the bottom look <laughs> this is by paris blue originals it has a little tag right there and I just love the shade, the texture, like what would you call it? The print. I just like how this looks, okay? I like how this looks. It's really a unique size seven. So, oh, I won't have a try on for these. If something doesn't fit me, then I don't have a try on because I couldn't get it on. So <laughs> yeah, whoever this fits, you're gonna be such a hot girl, okay? You're gonna be pulling looks left and right in these freaking classic jeans and it's a medium wash so you know medium wash goes with like everything everything okay a halter top midi dress it just has a hot pink lining with this black micro mesh overlay but it has sparkly flowers do you see do you see the sparkles okay they're really adorable perfect like homecoming dress or something like a special event type of dress when I saw this jacket, this is so freaking adorable. Cropped grunge jacket. And it just has like this bleach dye. I'm not sure if that's the correct term for this, but it has that type of detailing. It has this like that. <laughs> and then the back is like this huge graphic and it has a star in the middle and it says Prime Evil. That's the brand Prime Evil. And yeah, this is so cute and I like how it's cropped. Like I feel like usually these type of jackets like that I find are just regular jackets. Like I rarely find crop jackets that look like this. And it has like a high neck so it's like it's up here <laughs> but yeah that's this one this is so hot this reminded me of um twilight core as well bella swan core it's just like this crochet knitted baby doll henley and it has a hoodie and yeah super long sleeves brown velour midi skirt it's brown and red and it has a whole bunch of roses on it. This one didn't fit me either because this is the kid size. This is from Talbot's Kids and it's a size 14. So yeah, I couldn't make it work. I couldn't make it work, but it's so freaking cute. And it's like a burnout print. So yeah. Ooh, we have this black halter dress and it has ruching all down the front and all down the back. So you already know that's gonna make your body look amazing, like all the ruching. And then it has an asymmetrical bottom. And this is the perfect like homecoming prom dress. I might keep this one for myself, but it's this black, super long maxi dress. It has one super high slit and it just looked so good on. I'll insert the try on some wear and yeah i just love the star the star is a really nice detail this is modern day guess because the tag is printed on that's a good telltale sign between like vintage and modern items because most vintage items will have like a paper tag you could tell like it's a more modern piece but it's still so adorable so we'll see what i end up doing with this this super short micro mini skirt 
and yeah just look at it it's so freaking tiny and it's not a squirt it's not a score you already know how i feel it's not a score but it's still so cute i think this is more for like role play cosplay whatever because like girlies how do y'all get away with wearing micro mini skirts i still want to know because yeah this one is from hustler and another super cool detail about this is that it's velcro so you could just <laughs> rip it off but yeah there's that i've actually found this jacket before this is a abby dawn jean jacket and i literally sold the same exact jacket a couple months ago so yeah obviously i had to pick it up if you don't know abby dawn is avril levine's clothing line and everything abby dawn I need but yeah this one just has a whole bunch of studs and of course it has the skull skull buttons and I love like the acid wash on the back and yeah staple grunge jean jacket we have this blue marine cardigan and it's such like a nice material like it just feels so good this beaded bow and a whole bunch of flowers and bows but yeah we have that next we have this Hollister cardigan and it's so adorable like it's so cute and it has these little flowers and has the Hollister logo at the bottom and I love how it's like a deep V so you could put like a lace cami underneath. Yeah, it's just this dark blue color. And it's an extra small, so it fits like really fitted, you know? We have this grunge sweater. It's like this brown sweater with black graphics, a hoodie, back hit, and yeah, an oversized hoodie, so adorable. This sweater got me, like, it just got me, okay? This knit turtleneck sweater with mesh sleeves. And then you have like the knit at the cuffs as well. It's like the see-through, it's so cute. And it's a super chunky turtleneck that you could like fold over. It doesn't look like that. But yeah, just like this brown and pink colorway. And it just gives me like I don't know. I feel like this is something you would wear in like Paris. Like it just, you know, it's that type of vibe. But yeah, it's just really freaking cute with like a denim mini skirt. <laughs> a denim mini skirt and some boots. <laughs> you can tell I'm from Miami when you pair sweaters with mini skirts. Okay, like it don't get cold here. This is for Miami winters. All right. <laughs> Mall golf sweater, just black, red, and white, and it's by siren soles and it's an extra large but this is giving 3xl to me like this is big for an extra large but you'll see on me like this ain't no extra large but i always include like measurements in my listings like for this type of item i would include like the pit to pit and the length so even if it says extra large, like you can get an estimate of how it actually fits. And plus, obviously I model everything that I can. So you can see how it fits on me. And I put my measurements in the description as well. So yeah, that's how I do like everything. We have this tan rib sweater with contrast stitching. Super, super chunky. And this will actually keep you warm. This one is by DKNY Jeans. I also love DKNY. They're really good brands for 90s Y2K pieces. Oh, and this was actually a double zipper, which I didn't even realize until I was modeling it. But yeah, so you can zipper it both ways. This super, super soft Amber Crombie sweater. And it's just so soft. I think it's cashmere. Finest cashmere as it should be because it's super, super soft. And yeah, it has a v-neck and the little deer, the the deer logo. Let me know if that's a deer. It's a deer, right? 
and then i really want to keep this one too like this is so me it's just this little rhinestone tank top and it has like a heart and a whole bunch of little gems with these arm warmers like some black shorts and boots with some jeans Ugh. we'll see what i do with her too but yeah there's that when i saw these sweatpants when i saw these sweatpants like it's a denim pocket for me it's just these olive green flare sweatpants this one is by lucky penny i have this set it's like this blue set from this brand and it's so freaking cute and it has like a little heart right here and it's just giving me bubbles from the powerpuff girls i'll insert a picture of what that looked like but it was so adorable i still have it available in my store but bro it's just like this crop tank and capri set and it's it's so cute this baby doll top and it has these ribbons in the back that tie into a bone and it has a micro mesh floral bust and yeah super super cute i do believe this is my only juicy item in this haul which is pretty disappointing that's pretty disappointing i usually find more but yeah this is some vintage juicy track pants graphic right there classic but pockets yeah this is the pink tag juicy but yeah super cute color the tan and pink colorway so good this new with tags bisu bisu top took me forever to say that but yeah just this lace cami top and it has some beading we have this charlotte russe asymmetrical halter top this really unique colorway pink mauve and burgundy and yeah it just has the halter straps the back looks like that Ooh, so this one i'm definitely keeping so sorry so sorry to you but i have to keep this one it's this black waistcoat i don't have one of these and like finally i feel like this is a staple piece that everyone needs in their closet like a waistcoat and it has this little buckle in the back so you can cinch it in a bit and definitely keeping for me this white bb cropped track jacket it's just white and has these gold details a little heart zipper a drawstring hoodie and yeah this dkny black and gray tank top perfect classic tank top to just throw on with some jeans or a mini skirt this vintage 90s top it has bell flare sleeves a little slit and the super interesting part is the front because it has like this slit yeah so you could like tie it in the middle or you could just wear it open so that's really interesting i've never really seen a shirt like that this super hot mini dress or tunic tank top we have this gray i don't know acid wash it's a really yeah now the graphic is giving patriotic <laughs> we have this back graphic a hoodie super super hot the last three items are mini skirts so to start off we have this medium wash denim mini skirt it has this super adorable skull on the back is by unq and the front also has skull buttons like come on this one I just decluttered from my closet actually because I thrifted another mini skirt that basically replaced this one. You know, like if I'm going to keep that one, I have to get rid of one. So this one is going to you guys. It's this dark wash mini skirt and it has this chain detail, which is so freaking adorable. 
You can also detach it as well and use the chain for something else. It has a back pocket, I think it's fake. No, it's real. It's a real back pocket and just a dark wash tone. Last but not least, we have this super tiny express mini skirt and it's so freaking cute <laughs> it's this faded green camo color it has some red detailing right here that kind of looks like a face come on come on and then the pockets you can see from the bottom the back just looks like that this one i couldn't get on i'm pretty sure this is a size zero if i'm not mistaken it is a size zero so ain't no way Ain't no way I was going to get this on. But yeah, so freaking adorable. I almost forgot. I almost forgot about these shoes. Hold on. I thrifted these amazing current mood Mary Chains. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? These are so good. Oh my gosh. And they have like grommets and they're super freaking chunky these are a size 11 and yeah they're by current mood from dolls kill and are you kidding me they're so good i can't believe i almost forgot about these but yeah so yeah that's the end of the thrift haul like i said everything here if you like what you see it'll be available on my depop sooner or later if it's not already if you like this video make sure to like and comment make sure you're subscribed if you're not already and thank you so much for watching see you next time bye